Oh, hi, I'm back again. I think I'm just like never gonna quit vlogging or something. I don't know. Um, but I am gonna be out and about today. I have some epic big bags back there. If you guys watched my um, clean with me, my closet clean out, I'll link the video below. I'm finally taking all my stuff in today because it's not snowing. Yay. <laughs> um, and I did look and there is a clothes mentor that is closer to me. I'll put clothes mentors linked down below. That's where I'm gonna be going and selling on my clothes. I know a lot of you guys said like, try Poshmark or eBay or something. To be honest, that's just like way too much time and effort. I'd rather just take it to one place and if it doesn't sell, I'm gonna donate it. I am not that concerned about certain pieces. I mean, if I was gonna sell like a really nice pair of shoes or like a nice handbag or something that I knew was worth at least $100 or more, I would probably go that route. But to be honest, most of my stuff is like from Old Navy, Target. I've got some stuff from like, you know, Banana Republic and you know, I, I don't know. It's just not worth the time for me at this point. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna take both of those huge bags in and um, hopefully get some cash for it So I'm gonna go over there and then I'm gonna go and run and do all of my grocery shopping I will do a dedicated grocery haul video, but I will uh, bring you guys along. So yeah, I'm not sure how much I'll be able to show just because People don't really understand if you like try to stick a camera in your face and they're like what the heck's going on so <laughs> but I will try as hard as I can but it's just, um, I think it's only like one o'clock in the afternoon now so I'm gonna get rolling here and then my goal is to be back here by at least five because uh, the closest closed mentor to me is an hour away but everything is like an hour away and since I'm on the no spend I uh, or I'm, I'm not on the no spend. I think I'm gonna go through the McDonald's drive-thru and get a chocolate shake for the road because I've been craving that so bad. <laughs> But I will show you that when I get it. So I'm gonna go do that and then I'm gonna be on my way and that'll be like my treat for the afternoon. So I will see you guys in just a little bit. All right, friends, so I am at Clothes Mentor right here. I actually found one in um, Coon Rapids. I don't know if I told you guys that. But anyway, um, drove here, drank my chocolate shake and um, yeah, so I have a bunch of clothes. I'm gonna take it in and then I will uh, let you guys know how much I get. So I'll let you know. I got money! Um, okay, so I was just at Clothes Mentor and I got $64 for my clothing. Um, they took less than a third, but not a quarter. Um, so yeah, but I've had so much of that stuff in my closet for such a long time. They do check like the little labels. Some of the manufacturers actually put like a date of when it was manufactured. So if you're not into like the one to two year mark, they won't take it. So, um, which is fine because I obviously was not gonna be getting rid of everything today, duh. But um, I have that in the trunk of my car now, yay. And um, I'm just gonna go somewhere at some point. I don't. There might be like, I don't know if there's like a Goodwill or a um, donation center on my way home. I don't think that there is. I'll just make a special trip for that at some point. But but I need to remove them from the bags that they're in and put them in like um, bags I don't mind getting rid of because they're in like a nice <laughs> reusable bag. So I don't want to get rid of that. Um, and sometimes at those donation centers, um, you wanna make sure to like use a plastic bag because sometimes, especially with the weather that Minnesota's been having, um, sometimes there's like a little bit of liquid that gets stuck inside some of the bins and stuff. So anyway, um, I will do that at a different time because I didn't think ahead and didn't uh, bring some plastic bags with me, but oh well. All right, so I am headed home. Well, I'm not gonna go home. I'm gonna go close to home and then I'm gonna do my grocery shopping with my $64. <laughs> and um, I'll probably just use that cash and then anything above and beyond that for groceries. If I buy more than that, um, I'll just use my debit card because I haven't gone to the bank yet to get my cash out for my groceries, but that's okay. I can calculate in my brain, it's all right. Ah, and the phone's ringing, so I will see you guys in a little okay, bit. Okay, so I'm on to my last store. I've got my two Aldi bags back there, and I'm going to, you can't really see it, but I'm going to Cub. Um, they have, like, it's like a regular grocery store. Unfortunately, um, Aldi did not have all the things I wanted, so I had to add some things to my Cub list. That happens a lot, because Aldi doesn't always have all the things that I want, nor necessarily the brands that I want, so. Um, you know, it's more generic there, which is fine, but sometimes you can't find certain things or they just don't have it that week or that day or whatever, and that's all right. So, 
Aldi is over there. And then Cub is right here, so it's fine. It's like you can see the parking lots from each other. So I will come here to supplement and I will uh, see you guys when I get home. So I am back. I just filmed my haul, which is all back there. I've got to put it in the fridge because it's been sitting out for far too long. And then I'm going to go take the doodle on a walk and I'll be back in a little while. Trying to find a spot is really difficult right now because of all the snow. And it's covering all the good spots, right Doyle? <laughs> it's like, I don't know what to do. Another dog was there at one point. Must investigate. This is what walks with Doyle are like. He debates if he wants to go into the snow. Nope, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Oh. Back to dry land. Back to dry land. Tracking. Well, hi! It is basically time for me to say goodbye. It is uh, a little before nine o'clock. I need to actually go to bed a little bit earlier than I have been lately because I have a class tomorrow between, um, starts at nine and it's supposed to go till three. It's like some reemployment class. I don't know. I'm supposed to learn things. I think it's like a creative job searching class or something. So, Anyway, I am going to go to that tomorrow, so I don't think I'm going to vlog, but I think I'm going to put this video up tomorrow, um, like morning-ish time, maybe about nine-ish, um, so I'm going to edit actually right now, and obviously you guys already saw that I did my grocery haul, but I'm going to put that up tonight before I go to bed, because I know a lot of you have been like really wanting to see that, so I'm going to do that. I like to edit sitting on my sofa. <laughs> <laughs> with my Erin Condren blanket on. <laughs> ah, ah, my goodness. I have to get like comfortable and then I have to have water, which I'm almost out, but that's okay. I can get up and get more when it like starts saving and rendering and whatnot. But um, yeah, I'm gonna say goodbye for now. Thanks for hanging out with me today. I know it was kind of a, a boring day, but you did get to see Doyle for a little while on the walk. To be honest, that's what he does on walks. That's it. It's not very exciting. Um, he takes a while sometimes. But um, today wasn't too bad, but um, he did work it out, okay? He did work it out, so that was good. But um, yeah, I'm gonna get to editing. I gotta uh, take my trash out too tonight because it's Wednesday and they pick up Thursday morning. So I'm gonna do that as well. But there'll be more fun content coming up very soon. I am working on lots of good projects behind the scenes. And um, hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Feel free to subscribe, thumbs up, hit the bell, do all those things, questions, you can pop them down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.